the Vatican. Vatican City, Italy. In the 17th century, Pope Paul V ordered select documents of the Catholic Church moved from the Vatican Library and closed to outsiders until 1881. Today, the Vatican secret archives are closely guarded, and some researchers believe they contain revelations so explosive that they threaten the doctrine of the Catholic Church. You have to wonder if the secret library at the Vatican, which they acknowledge exists, doesn't have records or chronicles about extraterrestrial contacts that the Catholic Church has recorded and knows happened, but is keeping a secret. Might the Vatican's secret archives contain the details of messages Giordano Bruno may have received from extraterrestrials? Information that supports his pronouncements about the universe. When we look at certain specific examples, like Giordani Bruno, we know that there was so more to it than this. The Vatican archives, whenever they're going to be opened, are going to reveal extraordinary levels of details. According to researchers, the Vatican secret archives holds hidden evidence connected to the miracle of Fatima. It was here in 1917 that three children claimed to have received messages from what some Catholic theologians believe was the Virgin Mary. In Fatima, children saw an apparition they said was the Virgin Mary. And 70,000 people came to the same sheep pasture. And people said that they saw a spinning silver disc the Catholic Church, for a very long time, would not acknowledge what was happening with the children or Fatima. The extraterrestrials give to the children a telepathic message saying, you are not alone on this planet. We are here. We have been here some thousands of years ago. We observe you. Please prepare mankind that we will return again. All this story of Fatima went to the Vatican. But is it possible, as ancient astronaut theorists contend, that the Catholic Church censored the messages that were received in Fatima? The kids were given three messages, and the Pope refused to release the third message. The third message apparently talks about extraterrestrial life. Now that is sensational, because to me, to deny the revelation of that particular message, and that is exactly what the Pope did. And I wonder why. Some contend that the miracle of Fatima is one of many events that describe visitations from extraterrestrial messengers. Researchers also point to the voices described by Joan of Arc, visions received in Lourdes by Bernadette Subaros, and countless stories depicted in the Hebrew Bible, in which similar events are described. Perhaps the Vatican knows far more about life in the universe than they have acknowledged. But does a belief in alien life question the omnipotence of a supreme being? Of course the Vatican knows about extraterrestrial life. But to suggest that because extraterrestrials exist, that means there is no God is total nonsense. 